Wait, wait, wait. Don't give up yet. I want you to know that there are so many lives waiting on you. It's so many individuals that are attached to our lives. We are responsible for more than just our families. We are responsible more to more than just our loved ones. We are responsible for more than just our friends and and you know the people on on our jobs and you know us doing our part where we may be serving and so on and so forth but understand that our obedience is tied to someone else's delivery our obedience is tied to somebody else's healing our obedience is tied to someone else's saving our obedience is tied to someone else's calling. Our obedience is tied to someone else's purpose. Some, our obedience is tied to someone else's destination. We have no idea who, who our God has assigned to us. We have no earthly idea. You have no earthly idea. And I get it. Like, how can I think about so many other individuals if I'm going through it? How can I go out and, and, and encourage and inspire the world if I'm going through it myself? How can I build up the energy to get up and fight back when I've been kicked, knocked down, and, and talked about and handled so much for so many years? How can I stand up with my with my pride, like with like with 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 my posture? If I'm always feeling down and low on myself, how can I, how can I even want to carry on with the life that I've had? And honestly, that's just a chapter. Those are just the chapters of your past. Those are just the chapters in your book. Don't stop writing your book by giving up today in your life because the chapters in your book and the characters that have played a role in your book have not served you well have not meant you well who did not care for you like you deserve who wasn't there for you like you deserved and they hounded you and treated you a certain way like you were nothing Guess what? You have more chapters in your book. There's more characters that's coming that that you will write in your book. There's so much there's so much life. So much life in your chapters to come. A brighter life in your chapters to come. Excitement, joy, and peace in your life to come. And through you, God is going to reach so many other individuals, those individuals who he has assigned to you. And they're waiting on you. And if you die today, you have no idea how many individuals was waiting on you to introduce yourself to them. It's so many individuals. And I want to find out. I want you to find out. I want to find that out with you. So you will know, like, wow. It will be, it's going to be mind-blowing. How many individuals who's waiting on you. And when you, when you start to touch their hearts, when you speak, when you start to, to impact them by, by, by your greatness, and your unique touch. And when you get to meet them, you're going to see like, wow, I had no idea how many individuals would come to me like if it wasn't for you, if it wasn't for your message, if it wasn't for your artwork, if it wasn't for your transparency, if it wasn't for your kind heart, if it wasn't for for your you being polite that day, if it wasn't your encouragement that I needed because I was thinking about taking my life but you spoke 
you spoke life into me and because of it these are the awesome things that God is doing in my life and guess what guess what you are one of those individuals the world is waiting on you we're waiting on you do not look down with yourself anymore you're special you're unique you're great you're awesome you're fabulous believe that come on let's go let's go touch the world with your greatness there's so many individuals who's out there that's waiting on you and right now right now is the time for you to say <laughs> hello hello here I am as humble as you are it's time for you to give the world your voice let's go spread the love let's go share the love with the world we are waiting on you let's go